Hi everyone, this is Mr. Neil Reiseter, consultant audiologist and out of Cluax. Thank you for joining me in this interesting uh, case. It's of a patient who suffers from Parkinson's and uh, for that reason they, ha they had a slight head tremor which made it a bit more tricky and I decided to use the wax coat for that reason, uh, for the fact that the speculum can help stabilise um, the ear canal and, uh, and the tremors and it really helped. Um, you, you probably still notice a slight tremor. Uh, you can see it's like uh, just there in view, but um, I found it to be a lot more stable and uh, compared to the eye clear scope. I have previously treated the patient last year with the eye clear scope, so we did manage, but the wax scope uh, actually had its advantages in this case. So I've removed the lateral plug of wax and skin. I'm just going around the edge. I just want to remove some of this uh, surface coating, dead keratin wax, because the patient wears a hearing aid and uh, I just don't want the sample to be uh, occluded with wax um, as they're inserting the hearing aid. So just trying to remove as much as we can. They have got a, a narrowing, uh, quite a significant narrowing on the, the second juncture, the osseocartilineous portion of the ear canal. And we can see the eardrum there. Just having a good nosy around. Just want to see the attic, just to ensure there's no attic retraction. Uh, this is the right side. So again, you probably can see a slight tremor there, but the wax get really helped to minimise that. I'll just come out there. The patient moved a little bit there um, in response to the microsuction noise. We had a piece of wax and skin that uh, went up the suction tube and it made a quite a lot loud noise. It wasn't clarinetting, but it was just a sudden uh, suctioning of the wax. So it just came out, re-entered, just again stabilising the ear. I'm using the 4.25 millimetre specular here. Uh, and a standard zone of suction probe. We're just making these little concentric wriggle movements to detach the wax and skin. You can see that it's got a long layer of skin there. Just a bit of keratin, surface wax. And then this is the osseocartilineous junction where we are at the moment. And the patient's also got a narrowing on this side. And it's just some of the base of the ear canal. So I'm just trying to stabilize the ear once more. Again, you can see there's little tremors, but the patient was fine. They did get a bit of a gag reflex when I was removing this portion. I think for that reason, we might have decided not to continue any further with the gag reflex. But you see the eardrum there? It's no attic retraction, just we're looking that direction. Uh, if you are interested in the Waxgate, please do email info at clearwax.co.uk. Uh, we're hoping to launch, um, hopefully by the end of the year, uh, December. And if you do email us, we'll add you to our mailing list. Thanks.